Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Yeah, maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. You know what I was thinking, though? Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Let's check there. Let's check there. Hey, y'all think Joe might have checked in with Eddie at the Falcon? Hey, bro, did you check in with Eddie at the Falcon? Uh, yeah. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, I have not moved from this previous episode. We haven't been here for a good amount of time. But that's, that last episode got me hooked, bro. Let's finish this strong. We already know what's going on, bro. But before we do, what? Good job. Welcome back A, to another video for today. Always oh, nice to greet the people. You know what I'm saying? Hope that y'all having a good day today. I know I am, man. No complaints. Oh, gosh. Last time my phone rang like that, bro. Last time I rang in, in this house, it was a play. Maybe we got some good on the line. Hello? Vito, you ready? Does it sound like I'm ready? You just woke me up. So get the fuck up. We don't get the money for Bruno today. We're fucked. Where the hell are we gonna get our hands on 55 grand, huh? I don't know. We sure as hell ain't gonna find the laying around in bed. I got something for starters. A job from Eddie with a big payout. No shit. Yeah, I'll pick you up in a few minutes. So get dressed, grab a gun, and wait for me outside. I'll tell you more <laughs> this better not be one of your brilliant ideas, Joe. Hey, I'm not in the mood. Sorry, sorry. Didn't mean to snap at you. I'm still half asleep over here. Yeah, yeah, whatever. So you in or not? Sure, why not? How long till you get here? I'm calling from the gun shop around the corner. I'll be in your place in a minute. All right, I'll wait for you out back. I'll see you soon. Bruh. That one night of rest he got was the only piece he's had. That's the only piece he gets now was when he sleep. Oh, that ain't the life. You know what I'm saying? But I'm not going to spend the whole episode saying that over and over again. Y'all already know how I feel. What's up, Joe? Let's get this money, bro. What is this Roblox greeting we doing? Eddie gave it to us just for this job. Nice, huh? You drive. My head's still pounding from last night. We're going to Greenfield. Guess you hit the sauce pretty hard, too, huh? Yeah, I couldn't sleep either. Nothing a bottle of scotch couldn't fix, though. Scotch? Yeah, y'all remember last episode how I said, how I said uh, you drink and eat certain stuff and then your throat nerves uh, burn off? Yeah, scotch is when, um, scotch is automatic KO for your throat nerves, bro. drive away. Should be a piece of cake. Why? Eddie said it's a favor for some family from another city. Unfinished business. He gave me this envelope with all the instructions. Said it's got to be clean, and it's got to be done today. Why the hell doesn't the other family just do it themselves? Eddie said they've been looking for this guy for a while, and they just found him. They're afraid that if it ain't done right away, the guy's going to disappear again. Here, here's a picture. What'd this guy do? Says here he ratted his family out to the feds. The guy's got to come. Wait a minute. If he cooperated with the feds, that means he was under protection, right? What if he still is? Been it for years. We're getting paid a few grand for the job, so it's more than worth the risk. I have you say so. Hey, we need every penny we can get right now, right? So after we finish this job, we'll split up and look for other work. All right. Says here they want us to give him a message before we do it. Here, here it is. Okay, got it. Hey, if you see Eddie later, not a word about yesterday. He was never there. Last chink we saw was delivering egg food young. Get it? Yeah, what do you think I am? Some kind of retard? Jury's still out on that one, pal. Just making sure you don't slip up, that's all. Alright, so a lot of the family are getting um, infiltrated by the feds right now. I'm surprised they didn't bring up Henry being a part of the feds right there. Maybe they really don't think he is, but come on, bro. I don't know, bro. Y'all remember at the start of the first episode, though? Oh, I'm just thinking about that. I mean, not the first, the last episode. It opened... It opened with a gun, a shooter in the street, bro. And I was like, <laughs> I literally was like, no, he can't be the fed. Because he, he blew the old cop's brain bro, uh, bus, bro. What? Hold on, bro. Let me try that again. He shot both officers in the P, in the, in the, I still can't say it. Anyway, the cop's brain Number bus. You got to say? Yeah. All right. Here we go, then. <gasps> it's Frank. 
Tommy? Not t oh my gosh, it's Tommy. Well, I'm saying Frank. It's Tommy. I had to think for it. I'm like, whoa, this is Tommy's house. Wow. Tommy Angelo in the building, bro. That's crazy. Message from the Don. Mr. Angelo. Uh, yes. Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Oh my gosh. And it was crazy. Oh my gosh. Because it was crazy. They only did this for a quick cash grab, bro. Tommy's whole motive and everything for joining the mafia. I mean, it was just by chance. They hopped into his, his taxi cab. But like his reason for staying and like building this whole life, getting out the game came to a crashing end, bro. Because these niggas needed a check. Oh my gosh, bro. Okay. Call, okay. Those guys are Wow. Let's get the fuck out of here. Wow. Suspect is off. This is Agent Cox. We need police right, to right. Greenfield. Now, goddammit. Y'all ain't got the wheelies like me, bro. I'm gone, bro. Those were feds. That asshole really was under protection. And he's famous for conveniently leaving out little details like that. Maybe Oh, let's go, driver. I'm whipping right now, y'all. What's up? The whip skills is here. Oh, no. Please, Lord, give me an escape, Lord, please. Lord, I'm sorry. We fall down. Bro, look at my car. I was doing so good. Oh, fuck, that was close. Get me to Kingston, will you? I got a car waiting there. Hey, I almost forgot. Eddie paid me in advance, so here's your share. Okay, okay, three G's. All right, next job then. All right, good luck getting your hair for the money. Come by my place when you're done. Okay, I'll see you later. Drive to Derek and check if he has some work. Okay, all right. I am flying! I deserve to die, low key. In the game, in the game, in the game. You know what I'm saying? Words have power. You know what I'm saying? Let Let's see. Let's see if I can not hit these cars. I'm gonna just try my best to stay in the middle. It won't. It won't let me stay back here. Okay. 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 Nope. 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 Okay. Hey, I'm not mad at that. I'm gonna try again right now. Okay. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yep. 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 Right, uh, left lane. Left lane. Oh my God. Oh, if I would have drifted that. Oh my gosh, that would have made me a happy man. All right, Derek, I'm here if you got some work, bro. I'm going back to my first job, bro. This is, this is, this is uh, just funny how life works sometimes, bro. Gotta go back in here and face the music. I bet you finna talk so much trash. Get it off your chest, Derek. Hey, Hey, thanks for coming by. I knew I could count on you. What for? <clears throat> Frank's organizing a sit-down with the other bosses, and he took almost all my guys as bodyguards. So I don't have nobody around to handle this here job for me. Derek, these guys still don't want to work. What? Why? Because of that dead bitch you fired. Hey. Shit. Well, Vito, that other thing will have to wait. Can you help us out here with this first? What's happening? Well, this deadbeat didn't come to work for a whole week. Pretended he was sick. Total bullshit. So I fired his ass. 
Anyway, some of his buddies are upset and they're threatening to strike. All I gotta do is show up with a few guys who look like they mean business. That'll scare them and they'll forget all about it. I give you a thousand bucks. Are you in? All right. I ain't gonna say no to that kind of money. All right. <laughs> all you need to do is stand behind me and look tough. Right, Steve? We'll see. Oh, gosh. Is it fully loaded? Yep. Straight 200 rounds in this thing. They finna get used. This look like uh, Todd Packer from The Office right here, bro. That's my guy, y'all. Y'all know I met him? He cool. Oh, my gosh. These fucking guys really think who the fuck they are. This ain't the first time I have problems with them, you know. You uh, know how many of them there is? Three, four, ten. How the fuck should I know? Does it matter? Oh, no. It's just, uh, what are we going to do to them? All depends on how the uh, labor negotiations go. Just let me do all the talk. This? I don't need just opening your mouths and proving how stunages are. Bro, this is his response to an employee strike. They don't want to so, work. So, what's the problem here, fellas? We want you to give Big John his job back. It's me that decides who gets hired and fired around here. Why does and he I have six? All we're asking is for you to hire him back. He's got a family. He <laughs> needs a job. I've made my decision. See, I told you. Easy does it, Vinny. We want to do this Easy. peacefully. We bust our asses day in and day out for this fat fuck. And if anything ever happens to us, he'll screw us over Lower just like your he voice did John. Now, young man. I don't want to hear another word about that fucking dead. Who are you calling a deadbeat? A crate fell on the poor guy while he was working. For you. Broke both his damn hands. Well, oh, that's his man. fucking problem, not mine. What a dickhead, and bro. I suggest you just get back to work before somebody else's hands get you broke. You goddamn bastard! Now, you don't walk up to, to six Tommy guns, little the man. Those are really starting to piss me off. There's oh, no don't need do for it. violence. Please, put it down. We don't want no trouble. It don't look that way to me. Right now, it looks like you got big trouble, don't you? Now, if you all don't want to stop. Oh, I thought that was the job, pistol. You'll be back to work in the next 10 minutes. You see, Vito, all they do is bitch and moan. Vito? You're Skeletus boy, ain't you? I, your dad used to talk about you all the time. You look just like him. But what are you doing working for this bastard? After what he did to your old Shut man? Shut your fucking mouth right now. Don't listen to him, Vito. He's full of shit. Come on, let's go. Full of shit, huh? That bastard killed your father, Vito. What? Ooh. They're just trying to get under your skin, oh. Derek. Hey, stop pointing that gun Why at don't me. Don't you ask him how your dad drowned Trap. that night? We seen him take a walk with Steve. And then Steve come back alone, and all wet. Stop pointing that thing at me. What the hell happened with my father, Derek? Are you nuts or what? Who are you gonna trust, me or these now unemployed losers? We known each other for a long time, Vito. Think of all Why the were things. you all wet, Steve? You dive in and try to save him? Because he wouldn't stay underwater. Come on, shut! Vito, you swore an oath. Ew, and he's in there. Our loyalty to the family is greater than to our own families. Tell that to my mother. Eh, should I kill him? No, not here. We'll settle things with him later. You disappoint me, Vito. You really do. You disappoint me too, Wario, you fat, short time motherfucker. I'm gonna do a hell of a lot more than disappoint you, Derek. Casserole goblin. Now. I gotta get that fuck before he runs away. Time to teach that fat fuck a lesson. Vinny, oh you get my that? gosh. Matter. Let's go. We doing it right now? Okay, the odds are even. Now let's teach that all fat strapped? fuck a lesson. Man, not got... right. Follow me. Fuck y'all. No, man. They gotta let you do that, though. Like, as a developer, you have to... You can't drop some dime like that and then be like, oh... But still hide behind crazy like bro. Let me guys shouldn't be doing this. Lito can handle it. Okay. Okay. Extra firepower ain't gonna hurt. Let's go, Vito. We got your back. He's my boys right now. Okay. Okay. You're not finna kill my dad and think it's I'ma play it right. I'ma play it right. Fuck the left. Alright. Follow me, guys. This is crazy, fellas. We shouldn't yeah. be doing this. Vito can handle himself. Some extra fireball ain't gonna hurt. Let's go, Vito. We got your back.
Ja, 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 ja. If Vito's dad was in his life, that would have changed the course of all of this, bro. Oh, Derek! Steve! Get the cover, get the cover, get the cover, get the cover. Oh my gosh. Alright, bro. We could still work this out, Vito. As he throws a whole Molotov at my scalp, like, come on, bro. Work this out. Oh shit, there's two of them, there's two of them, there's two of them. You think you could just fucking do something like this and walk away? Y'all fuck! I know this ain't supposed to be a boss battle. Miss your old man, Vito. Don't worry. Oh, this dude, this, this dude, wild disrespectful. No! No! What do you think of Vito? You think you could just fucking do something like this and walk away? I'm not, I'm not hearing none of his shit, bro. Bitch. I spent my whole life trying not to make the same mistakes now. Following in his footsteps. It was good to finally know the truth. Derek's death also helped me resolve another problem. Bro, if you don't find this safe, I'm going straight to his office. I still got I still got some grenades. This opened up before. Oh, there it is. All I had to do was push E and I got it open. Or is it F? No, okay, so it is locked. Come on. Come on. What is that? What the? F what the? F I gotta get up out of here. They gonna keep coming in like this. I mean, that, that. So I was doing the right thing. Oh, bad. Whoa. Looks like I just found Derek's retirement. That's boss. okay. Okay. See, I do got a little bit of Franklin Saint in me, bro. It's just Franklin. You know, he wasn't born a killer either. You know, if you seen the show. I be trying to spare uh, all types of critters in my house. Spiders, I let them live. I let spiders live. That's probably stupid, but I've, I'll swat the mess out of a fly, though. You know, we can take things from here. What about the cops? Yeah, they might be a problem, but anyone who saw will swear we did it in self-defense. You were never here. All right. Good luck then. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. God help you all. That dude is a real one. Rob shops or bring cars to Brewski. Officer down! Officer down! Shoot I'm in too deep. I'm, I'm, I'm in too deep. I'm in too deep. No, you hit my car. You can't bring Give me gun. the money Please, now. No. Give me the money now. Give. Get out the way. Get out. Get out the way. Get out the way. Get out. Yo. Don't hurt me. Yep. Don't yep. Hurt me. Got my way. Ain't you? Hold on, hold on, hold on. You, she's looking kind of. My fault, Lee. I didn't mean to. I didn't mean to hit you like that on my way out. My fault. I didn't mean to do that. You looking kind of smooth though. Look, I stay over at Joe's house. You see how I left it open ended for her? Like I let her decide. Like, do I? This, in her brain, she like shit. Do I go to Joe's or do I stay here? It's like whatever you feeling, you know. I'm gone. And I'm in a new car. I'm wanted, but they don't know where I am. A hundred dollars. I gotta earn how much? Where, where, where Drewski at? <laughs> I mean, a Brewski, bro. Oh, it didn't matter what condition. I'm crushing this thing anyway. Bro, this is for show the, the game's way of being like, okay, make sure that you um, use all of our features before you go. Like, ain't nobody trying to do this shit right now. $400, that's it? All right, doing a little bit of robbing now. Oh shit! No, please stay away. <laughs> okay, civilian. Wow. Oh, looks like no, I, no, I just, no. Just found Derek's retirement funds. I was two hundred dollars away from 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 being done with this. Two hundred dollars. All right, you have collected enough money. Go see Joe. On my way. Something tells me when I meet Joe, he's not gonna have as good of luck as I am. And uh, 
No, nah, actually, I take that back. I feel like Joe's actually going to have his money. It's just going to go south after that. Joe wasn't playing no games today. Not the ominous music to open it Joe up. Joe wasn't home. At first, I thought he was just running a little late, so I went to grab something to eat. Do not play with me right now, man. Two hours later, Joe still wasn't home. It was getting dark, and I was getting worried. I had to go look for him. No, no, no. This is, makes me feel like Max Payne. Six hours later. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes you just got to ask yourself twice. I smoke a little too much banya, and I'll ask myself that same question eight times. Still not have an answer. I get in the car, start driving, forget where I'm going. Like, it's, it's real in the field, bro. I, I really ain't just folded somebody in the street in a while, bro. Oh, shit. I remember why. I remember why. You got... you. Oh, my gosh. It won't let me disengage. Don't kill me, please. Run, 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 run. Oh my god. That nigga got me together real quick, boy. Is this running distance? No. I need a whip. Stop, bro. Stop, bro. Please, bro. Suspect is about six feet tall, dark hair, medium build. 10 floor. All right. Maltese Falcon Joe, please be in here. This car is so clean, though. My lord. Uh. Let me into the Falcon, man. Officer down! Officer down! Shoot this asshole! Copy that. <laughs> Use extreme caution. Use of automatic weapons is authorized. I needed to die anyway. The sun, something wouldn't, you know, it wouldn't open. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Bro, it's episode glitch galore, man. <laughs> Bro, why am I still wanted? I died at the hands of the police. Like, what do you need? They really heard I got that 27 thou on me. They want they cut. Okay, look, no police interaction. Smooth sailing so far. It's not the car that's wanted. It's the man driving it. Excuse me, sir. The tire popped and drifted my car to the left. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Yeah, maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. You know what I was thinking, though? Um, Maybe Joe checked in with Eddie at the Falcon. Let's check there. Let's check there. I think Joe might have checked in with Eddie at the Falcon, too. Hey, y'all think Joe might have checked in with Eddie at the Falcon? Hey, bro, did you check in with Eddie at the Falcon? Uh, yeah. Thanks. Eddie! Eddie. <laughs> yeah, you're killing me, bro. Vito, good, you're here. You, uh, you hear what happened? Well, wow, what's going on? Henry's dead. Oh, what? okay, cool. The fucking attacked him to death in broad daylight. W why? So you don't know anything about it. Well, uh, Henry wanted to bring me in on some deal, but I passed. What happened? Yeah, well, Henry is, well, was stupid. He was dealing dope with the tongs. He knew this was off limits and he got caught. Carlo let him off with a small fine and told him he'd forget about it. But the chinks double-crossed Henry and hacked him to pieces in the middle of the park. Shit. Ain't no doing business with the yellow man. But there's worse. Henry wasn't working alone. Yesterday, some guys massacred a shitload of the chinks over in Chinatown. Now they figure it must have either been us or Vinci. They already started threatening Vinci. If this don't get settled fast, we're all in deep shit. You sure you don't know nothing about it? Not a thing, Eddie, I swear. Wow. Yeah, 
How about Joe? Joe? Joe was with me last couple days. Uh-oh. Well, you're lucky, then. Carlo's out of town right now, but when he gets back, <laughs> it ain't gonna be pretty. Oh, shit. You better not be shitting me, Vito. Fuck. Let's try Giuseppe next. He keeps his ear to the ground. Let's try Giuseppe next. Oh my gosh, man. I... Little 360 jump in? Ugh, I'm gonna do that every time I get in the web. Ugh. Giuseppe! 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 I went all the way around, huh? Giuseppe! Talk to me, bro. I can't find Joe nowhere, man. I'm, I'm scared. Hey, Giuseppe, I'm looking for Joe Barbro. Was he here today? I don't know, Vito. Yeah, Joe came by today. Great, I've been looking for him the whole day. Did he say where he was heading? Well, no, he didn't. I don't think he know himself. How come? Well, he was looking for a job, but before we managed to finish our conversation, a few guys came and took him away. What? Who? It was Vinci's people. They said Mr. Vinci wanted a word with him. You know where they would have went? No, lo so. Maybe to the bar, the Mona Lisa. Shit. Is there something wrong? Not sure. Let's just say we're not on the best of terms with Mr. Vinci these days. Yeah, Joe didn't look too happy. I got a bad feeling about this. I better go find out what's going on. I hope it's nothing serious. Buona fortuna, Vito. Buona fortuna. Oh my gosh, my boy Joe finna get done up like, uh, he finna get done up like it's a uh, prom night, boy. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, your girl looking good with her makeup. That's how you. Uh, I'll see y'all when we get there. So maybe I won't kill you. Okay. Hi, Look at the balls on this guy. Nice to see you too. Don't move a muscle. Come on. Listen to the friendly bartender and stop fucking around, Vito. Now, first of all, I gotta ask you to slowly toss your guns on the floor. No funny business neither. The bartender's got the itchiest trigger finger in town, huh? I'm not armed. Okay, so what are you doing here, Vito? We wasn't expecting you. I'm looking for Joe Barbaro. I heard some of your guys picked him up. Eh, yeah, maybe. What are you trying to pull? Me and Joe didn't do nothing to you. Mr. Vinci doesn't seem to think so. He wanted a few things explained to him. So that's what Joe is doing. And since you've stopped by, why don't we go and join them? And what if I don't want to? These guns say you do. But don't worry. It's got a hell of a view. Woo! Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I mean, we got a solid story. Joe Shit. seems like he. Ah. Uh. Hey, what's up, Joe? The assholes went to take a leak. <sighs> Great. Well, can you explain to me why the fuck we're here? That old fuck Vinci can't see what's going on right in front of his face, and he thinks I can explain it to him. Idiot. Oh, the happy couple is here already. Welcome, Vito. What's going on? You got no reason to treat us like this. No reason? No reason? First, the business with Leo. And then all hell breaks out in the city. The ch they're going nuts. Everybody's fighting like lunatics. And now, those yellow bastards are threatening to kill me. It's out of fucking control. Now, I'm too old for this shit. So you're gonna tell me what the hell's going on here? Come on. I'm all ears. Mr. Vinci, look. <laughs> I don't know what the hell's going on here. Believe me, me and Joe ain't got nothing to do with it. That ain't what I want to hear. Yeah, well, that's your problem. Because we don't know shit about any of this. That's too bad. Finally, we don't got much time. We got to do something. All right, we'll try to break the pipe. Come on, help me out. I can't do it by myself. Okay. One, two, three. Where's Vito's One, blood out on his face? Two, three. Let's Again. Slow it. One, two, three. Oh, there it is. Fuck you, you filthy fuck. Come on. Oh. Come on, you fuck. Oh, this is wild. 
Man, fuck stealth. Well, that, ain't, that ain't how we play. Just think about it, y'all. Think about it. The coolest stealth game you've ever played. How do you get clips in that? Like, you know what I'm saying? Ain't nobody trying to see no stealth clip. Unless it's swag. And it's probably hard to do that in a, in a stealth game, you know? It's like, a, like, a, like a, a fire stealth game clip would be a montage. And even then, you got to put in like countless hours. Get him, Joe. Get him, Joe. My health low. My health low, bro. Fuck this. I'm out of here. Low. Low, nigga, bro. Y'all surprised? Okay, Joe. I'm out of bullets, bro. I'm like, why am I not shooting anything? Bro, I got one bullet, Joe. He know it. He know it. He know it. He know it. Crazy clip incoming. Crazy clip. Crazy clip. Crazy clip. Let's go. That wasn't as crazy as I wanted, but still, it felt good. You go first. I'll cover you. All right, come on, Joe. We out. We out. We out. We out. We out. Bro, I'm not built for this one, bro. I don't know about this fight, Joe. You talking about, bro, you must know I got six rounds. Like, bro. Get him, bro. Yep, 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 yep. Good shots, good shots. Keep going, keep going. Stun him, yep, yep, yep. Good shots, good shots, Joe. You sat down. Are you like that? Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Good shit. Come on. What's the matter with you? He's right there. I can't see nobody. I can't see nobody, bro. Vito, come here. This should be the way out. All right, all right, all right. But that fire crazy. This way, this way. Follow me, boy. <sighs> Did y'all see me scan my whole desk to see what I could smash? I'm not breaking into the mic, bro. Oh, that Magnum sit him down. Pause. I don't even know that's a pause, bro. I'm gonna...
Hop out! Hop out! My gosh, bro. That don't make no sense. Joe, I don't know where I'm going either, man. I'm seeing that same fly. Here we go. It's only a matter of time for you to fly right up to my face. Say what's up. Y'all said I had it wrong. It's not the it's not like me breathing, you know what I'm saying? That attract them. It's, I think I said something about like CO2 or something that I'm emitting. I don't know. <laughs> Come on, bro. Oh, here it go. Alright, I got nades. I'm ready. I'm ready. Back on my militant. Back on oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Whoa! <laughs> Gotta land those Berlin. Gotta land those Berlin. This is psycho. They ran up on me. They're gonna start me. Okay, thank you. Thank you, game. Oh, my, my stomach hurt. Like, fuck you, man. Stupid plan, bro. That fly threw me off for a sec. I got it. I got it. I sat up here and bigged up my pistol game too, bro. I gotta, I gotta finish this with the pistols. You doing too much right here. What's up? Oh, fuck this. Bring your bitch ass here. Wow. If I'm Franklin Vito, Saint, let's get you over there. Y'all okay. know who let's this is. Get the doctor. What's with Vito, the audio right now? They fucked me up pretty good. Think I need a doctor. Okay. Let's get you over there, El Greco. Get out of there. No, no, come on, have a heart. Ain't no, ain't no time for that, bro. Oh, no. Here, of course, the police hey, are right here, huh? Greco's gonna My fix chest. you. Yeah. Hey, El Greco's gonna fix you. Your... Game two buggy, bro. The more bro. you whine about it, Fuck. the worse it's gonna be. So listen, Vito. The more you whine about it, the worse it's gonna be. Thanks. Hey, we're in coming together, after right? me. Just like us. Getting yourself killed. Now just listen, Vito. Get the fuck back before you get blood all over my pants, yeah, and I really do stab you in the chest. We're coming. Hey, we're in this together, oh. right? Just like us. The hell of a time to turn into just a fucking get the fuck back before you get blood all over my pants, and I really do stab you in the chest. <laughs> oh, you picked the hell of a time to turn into a fucking comedian. That's my tire again, bro. That's crazy. We getting six feet tall, dark hair. This car clean as a bitch. We getting Joe to the hospital, and then. If the chapter ends, we're ending it, bro. If it doesn't end, we're still ending the episode. I've been at this for an hour and a half, and I barely did like 40 minutes worth of stuff. Spent more time at Brewski's than I did the mission. Oh, not the hospital, the dock. 
family died. I can make it. What do you want me to do with the money? Take it to Bruno. All right. At least that'll be out of the way. Good evening, gentlemen. Oh, what happened to you? Hey, Doc. I got my ass kicked at... <coughs> I'm coughing up what blood. What is happening today? One of your uh, guys is already here. Uh, Who? His name is Antonio Balsamo. Tony Balls? What happened to him? Somebody messed him up pretty good. Uh, I don't think uh, he's ever going to oh, walk again. What? <laughs> this surprises you? All the blood. Uh, all the death. Oh, oh, this is oh, the oh. lifestyle you choose. Uh, Facts. One day your Facts. luck is bound to run out. Facts. Next time, it could be you. Facts. Sermon, Doc. You have time to treat Joe? Yes. That's how y'all sound. Huh? That's how y'all feel? Antonio up. That's okay, Doc. All right. Come in. Make sure you settle things with Bruno, okay? And Vito. Thanks. Sure thing. Feel better. Wow. Hey, Bruno back. Everything's showing up double time. How far is Bruno from here? All right, he up the street. No, he's not actually. He's the very bottom. So much driving. So I'm gonna let y'all know right now as we're, as we're wrapping this game up, I am not playing Mafia 3. Cause I hear it's even more of this. Just back and forth, running missions, driving, shooting. Like the shooting, I don't mind, but the, just the driving back and forth this city in this like old school driving setup. Like the driving don't even really be fun like that. Are you fucking kidding me, bro? Okay, I made it in one piece. They trying to get me up out of here. Bruno, I got your bread, man. I need to see Bruno. Got the money? Yeah. Come on in then. You're lucky. We were just about to leave. See how friendly he got when I brought the bread? Good evening. You have the money for me? Or do you wish to extend the deadline? Here it is. <laughs> I have to admit, this is somewhat of a surprise. I heard you boys had some... complications. Yeah, we did. I heard that Henry is dead. I'm very sorry to hear that. Isaac, count it. So your little business venture was a success? You got your money, right? Right, right. It's just that the whole city has been turned upside down. The Chinese think the Italians attacked them, so they're going after Vinci. That's not good. Not good. Would that have anything to do with the reason you borrowed this money? Sorry, Bruno. That's none of your business. Uh, thank you, Isaac. It looks like the debt is settled. I don't even know your name. Let's keep it Vito. that way. Okay. Vito who? Vito Scaletta. Eh, Scaletta. I knew a Scaletta once. But I must say, you're much better at paying back your debts than he was. His poor wife had to do it for him. So it was you who lent my father the money. <laughs> your father. Ah, like father, like son. I see you don't approve. But I didn't make him borrow the money, now did I? Just like I didn't make you. If you ever need a loan, you know where to find me. <laughs> sure. Paraspera ad astra. I couldn't no, I sleep. I said that all wrong. Things were bad. And they were only gonna get worse. And I'm only gonna end it right here. Alright, ladies and gentlemen. That is episode number eight, I think, of Mafia 2. Damn, is it really only episode eight? That's crazy. Yeah, it seems like... Let me see if I can guess this ending. What I think is going to happen is... Honestly, I don't know. I don't. I can't tell if Vito is out the code game now and he just wanted to clear the dead and call it a day. Or what? I don't know what Joe's mind is. It's just getting bleaker and bleaker, though. We'll wrap this up very soon. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you slap a like, subscribe if you are new, hit that bell so you always know when I'm posting videos, bro. I love you guys, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.